Rumors have swirled for years about Apple's VR and AR ambitions. The company does have ARKit, its augmented reality software development platform, but Apple still hasn't made hardware of its own. Last week, however, a handful of reports gave us clearer details on Apple's AR and VR hardware plans than we've ever heard before. It started with a report from the information that painted a picture of Apple's ambitious potential headset. The device is said to include a dozen or more cameras for tracking movement and showing the real world to the wearer. That'll be coupled with two 8K displays, giving it an effective resolution that would far outstrip anything currently on the market. It sounds like Apple's headset will be fully sealed, so the wearer won't be able to directly see anything in the real world. With two 8K screens, it should offer an extremely immersive VR experience, and the cameras will allow the device to show the wearer what's going on in the real world with information or virtual objects overlaid on it. Those cameras will enable the device to track eye movements as well as hand gestures. It'll also have LiDAR sensors, like those found on the iPhone 12 Pro and iPad Pro, to help measure the distance between objects in the real world and properly scale and present virtual objects in a physical space. The headbands for the device are said to be interchangeable and will include spatial audio technology similar to what's in the AirPods Pro and AirPods Max. And it sounds like Apple's working on its own in-house chips to power the headset. No big surprise, given that it makes its own silicon powering nearly all of its hardware these days. The information believes that the headset is in the later stages of development and could ship as soon as 2022. But given these potential specs, it's not going to be cheap. The price point is rumored to come in around $3,000. Given the advanced hardware and high price, it's clear that this is less a device for consumers and more a competitor to Microsoft's $3,500 HoloLens 2. This report corroborates other things we've heard over the years. Back in 2018, CNET was the first to say that Apple's VR device would feature dual 8K screens. And Bloomberg reported last month that the headset would be focused on virtual reality and include an advanced external camera system. A recent executive shuffle might also point to Apple getting more serious about its VR project. In late January, Apple's Dan Riccio moved from his position as head of hardware engineering to a new, unnamed project. Shortly after Apple made this announcement, Bloomberg reported that he was heading up the team working on Apple's headset hardware. The publication also claimed that the headset team was working through unnamed struggles, and Apple hoped to reach those experience would lead them through it. It's important to note that Apple has confirmed none of this, aside from Riccio having a new role working on an unannounced project. This could all easily amount to nothing, but with years of Apple headset rumors coalescing into more concrete details reported by multiple publications, 2022 might finally be the year Apple makes a big move into virtual reality. Thanks for tuning in. If you like what you see, click subscribe and stay tuned to Engadget for more news.